And uh, he highlighted more of the older ones that were there. So I don't know that we've got too many of these. Um, well, know, this, this is supposedly all original. Yeah, now another thing in this year in these cars, these Mopars, you look at those windows again, you notice how much glass area there was. That was a big selling feature on Mopars that year. Yeah. Extra viewing. Yeah, look at the back window. Yeah. Yep. That is a lot of glass. I had two four barrels yeah, on the course. back window in that. You're right. Very cool. 1966 Dodge Coronet 440. No, four, uh, 440, but is that, actually that's the model because that's... Um, uh, yeah, there was a... There was a, there, there was a model 440. Was a, a, a model, a 500. Yep. yep. Coronet 500, and then it was a 440. Now, in its day, you bought one of those new. What kind of gas mileage are you going to get in something like that, Bill? When, in, in its day? Yeah. When, you I mean, probably were. It's not an economy car, that's for yeah, sure. Yeah, no, 12. but you were still probably pulling 15 to... Well, that's pretty darn good. Yeah, you know, this one just got a 318 in it. No, I'm talking about the ones with 440s, I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Heck, I don't oh, think yeah. you, you could gauge it because you couldn't go from gas station to gas yeah, station. Yeah, yeah. Who I cared? I, I, had the, I had the 383, and I remember sitting in gas lines up in New York for hours and hours and hours, all the time. I can remember us every pawn in a buck each on gas and go the whole night. Yep. Yeah. But you look at the 66 to the 70. You look at the actual body style. Mm -hmm. It's not that. Drastic a difference no, until a little they got sharper to the lines on the '66. Yeah. A little, little harsher, sharper yep. lines. On more it. But the other ones, off. they started to round them off a little. Right. Bit. But it was the Challenger, I think, mm -hmm. that was the first one of that that yeah. Yeah. Nice duster. This one's a 1970 Plymouth duster. And a '71 Demon. Wish I had it back. And again, this is a car that really has come on in the last few years. I, I think that people are, you know, waking up to the fact that some of the lesser models mm -hmm. out there, if you can't afford a Cougar yep. or a Challenger or a Roadrunner, right. this is right. the way to go. Yeah. 1942 Dodge Command car. Now this is what I need. All stock, World War II. I guess those things are still around. <coughs> yeah, they are. But boy, I mean, they're they're really hard to find. Those that military club has got some interesting vehicles mm -hmm. in it. It's oh, fun oh, to yes. go to a show where they come in with those oh, military. Yeah. You vehicles. see them at um, Devereaux. Devereaux. Mm -hmm. Kaiser Devereaux. They come yeah. in. Even our show, uh, they bring a few of them in there. Yeah. We usually have yeah. four or five. We tried to get them one year for rods and wings, and uh, there was a conflict. They had another event that they were. Pre That's a really before. nice, nice vehicle. But mm -hmm. yeah. Some very cool. And you always pictures. thought of uh, thought a Jeep, you know, uh, but there certainly was other makes and so on that they were making mm -hmm. military-wise. Now, if you want to drive one of those to the show, you want to uh, allow a little time. Yeah. They don't have a road speed of 75 miles an hour. That's no. a fact. <laughs> they were meant to go over those rough roads, weren't they? <laughs> yeah. Ah, yeah. uh, and he snuck in. He, oh, he snuck in that last one for us. A 2005 Dodge SRT4 Stage Two. I mean, everything is open at a different angle. <laughs> Lamborghini and it, doors. And it's a four door. Yeah. 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 Really unusual. And, and you know, uh, we talk about the future and where that's going, and you know whether we'll see more and more of that. Um, I'm glad to see that someone like that mm -hmm. came to a show. Yes. Um, oh, know. that's sure. And that's doing what they're doing on the car. Yeah. Yeah. We have a class for those in our, oh, our show. Yeah. We're an antique automobile club. We've got a class for those kinds. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you look at the time yeah. that he's got it. Look at Ryan Mingoy. Yeah. What yeah. he's done to that Mustang is nice. Exactly. Yeah, but you remember when we started bringing the imports in at Checkers. They weren't real. All brought to you in part by? Heels and wheels. wheels. That guy. That guy. Oh, I tell you. Yeah. They still got it. What were you saying? Well, when remember we were when, we, when we brought the imports in the checkers yes. weren't real well thought of in the beginning. Right. And, and it was tough in the was, beginning to get hard. acceptance with the yeah. guys. But that was a good yeah. group of kids. Okay, she's, she's down to three of these and one of these. So we're going to be back in just a couple of minutes after a word from our sponsor. New Year's Trim Shop in Venice. Our award-winning interiors have been applauded locally and nationally. Juniors will repair or replace seat covers, carpet, door panels, and both vinyl and convertible tops. 
Our experts have more than 40 years of experience and specialize in original, antique, and custom automobiles, boats, and aircraft. For quality craftsmanship at a reasonable price, call Juniors today, 493-1840. That's 493-1840. Hearing Aid Centers with offices in Dennis, Inglewood, and now Sarasota offer free comprehensive hearing tests and video ear inspection. Friendship Hearing offers the best guaranteed prices on top quality hearing aids. 100% digital hearing aids programmable by the computer start at only $8.99. Friendship Hearing is where service, quality, and price come together. Friendship Hearing Aid of Venice, Inglewood, and Sarasota, serving the Gulf Coast since 1992. Whether it's new or used, antique or special interest, whether it's a car, truck, boat, or specialty item, find it fast, find it free, every week at Keels and Wheels Magazine. With hundreds of locations in Manatee and Sarasota, if you need to sell it, put it where thousands of people will see it. Put it in Keels and Wheels Magazine, serving Southwest Florida for over 22 years. With the largest and widest circulation of any magazine of its type, where buyers look first and where sellers ought to be. Call us today, Keels and Wheels. It's your photo advertising source, because it works. It really works. Hi folks, this is Lance. I want to tell you about my friends Casey and Chris over at Casey's Classic Cars in Bradenton. Casey's Classics turns out some of the most beautiful restorations I've ever seen. His own inventory of muscle and classic cars would make even Jay Leno envious. Casey's Classics has over 7,000 massive square feet of shop and showroom space. They're a full restoration and performance shop from the minor to the major and the mild to the wild. Call Casey at Casey's Classic Cars in Bradenton at 941-747-1800. Come on, give your classic ride the sound system it deserves. Hi, I'm Gary Taman. We can put new sound in your car while keeping its classic appearance. Upgrade your existing radio for AM FM stereo with incredible sound. Reproduction radios, new stereo starting under 150, MP3 or satellite, no problem. We also have speakers that sound great without cutting that classic interior. Give us a call, 941-371-8924, or see us on the web at TaymanElectrical.com. Now that's much better. Are you a hot rod, custom, classic, or even a performance enthusiast? Then check out Cruisin' Style Magazine, America's number one source for car shows, cruise nights, and events from coast to coast. Cruisin' Style Magazine features the latest tech articles, how-tos, build-ups, classifieds, photos, and more. You can check out the current and back issues of Cruisin' Style Magazine on our website at cruisinstyle.com. If it's happening in the world of rods, customs, and classics, we've got it covered. Cruisin' Style. The Competitive Edge is not just your ordinary car repair shop. At Competitive Edge, owner Herb Yancer takes on the car repair jobs that the other shops can't handle. It doesn't matter if it's just your normal passenger car or a high-performance vehicle. The Edge has you covered. Herb also specializes in custom engine building and cylinder head repair. So if you want the job done right, give Herb a call. He has over 30 years' experience, and no one can do it better. All right, welcome back to Collector Cars. Our featured sponsor tonight is Mary Patty with AAA Insurance. Huh? Huh? You think that'll get me off the uh, out of the doghouse with Mary? 45 <laughs> seconds. 45 All seconds. Right. Here's what we got. 40 seconds. We got a new sponsor that I want to tell you about. We got, they're doing a countdown on me here. That's because you, my Gabby, guess here. No, 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 no. The Don't Muscle focus. Car Garage with Tim and Rhonda Hill. Brand new sponsors. They're coming in. Uh, we're going to be at Stefano's on Friday, this coming Friday. Saturday is Hooters in Bradenton. Sunday is Giovanetti's down in Port Charlotte. And unfortunately, that's all we got time for. Mr. Petty. Bye. Good to see you. Bill, <laughs> thanks for coming out. Yeah, and don't home. forget to get out to the AACA show. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Mergens. Hey, everybody. Keep on cruising. Folks, thanks for tuning in. We'll catch you next week. God bless. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.